Phil, our sort of, you know, figurehead or fifth member, you know, he said, listen, you should record that song, Clocks, because I was saying, oh, no, we're going to, you know, save this one. And so quite rightly he said, you know, put that song on because it's good. And that, that was the newest to go on, Clocks. He goes, do no 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 It's just like fishing, basically. The way I or we approach songs is you just, if you wait long enough, you know. It could go on for hours. <laughs> I won't go on for hours. It helps if you have a piano. But something might come. And then I'll be off. It's like a production line. You kind of, Chris will start off with a basis of a song, like chords and a melody and maybe some a handful of lyrics and then he'll take it to one of us or, you know, all of us, and it'll just kind of develop. You know, in the studios especially, you can you can start to layer things up quite quickly and try different sounds, and it usually just kind of evolves. Maybe it'll be a, a bass line that'll take it one way or a drum beat that'll take it another way, and kind of it all just adds up. the amazing thing about our band is you, know, you play something you think that's all right I like that and then to Johnny we'll come in and then he put on these brilliant chords and then the chorus came out and then it all sparked off and then guy came in and put on his bass line and then that sparked off another bit it's a, like a big chemical reaction our songwriting process and it's really exciting we all kind of have an equal say about what we think the other should do so it's kind of all quite democratic it's like pop idol for, for our songs the end product is, is something that all four of us have okayed at one point. You know, it's, a, it's a huge selection process. You know, you're, you're coming to London. You're not coming to London. Yeah, see what I'm saying?